Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your man, Rand, Zero Dog 40 here. Bring you a little short video. Uh, it's kind of pressed for time today, but you know what? Hey, no excuses. We got to get in and get the work done. So as I started out today, basically flat bench, three sets going up, three sets coming down. Um, I'll definitely in the description box, I'll have the sets and rep ranges for each of these exercises and their names. Um, so you definitely won't have to keep going back to the video. You can just look there in the description box and get the information you need. Uh, for me, it was 135, 225, then 315, 315, 225, then 135, and I'll have that rep range in the description box. Um, as we move on from here, we go to a lying uh, flat back bench, and basically I use this exercise to work on my finishing on my press. Uh, right where you get stuck at the top of a lot of presses, just squeezing that pectoral muscle, squeezing those triceps to actually lock that weight out. This is a really good exercise for that and also works on your smaller muscles for stabilizing. Really good, really good exercise. The next one we have here is your hammer strength incline press. Love this machine because it gives you really good range of motion and it holds your form tight keeps your form tight so you can really concentrate on bringing those hands in and squeezing that pectoral at the top. Getting really good pump, getting a really, really good pump with this machine. Now we move over to your basic old school incline dumbbell press. I went with some 70s today, got some good work with those today. I went about four sets of 10, I think. Um, really, really concentrating on squeezing that pectoral at the top, bringing that weight in and squeezing. So hey guys, I hope this information has been great. I hope you liked the video. Let me know, uh, and I'll see you guys next time. All right.